guys, I know there's some stuff here, but welcome back. Today, um, we're going to be doing, um, new art compared to old art. So basically, we're going to be taking, um, for example, maybe how I draw a cake or a cupcake and see how I do it now and see what I did, how I did it a long time ago. So I'm really excited. So let's jump right into this video comparison <laughs> so anyways um we're gonna start off with the basic face so i have actually done a lot of faces before but i'm gonna show you um like i've done a lot of faces that i've done that are new and stuff but the first face that I did and I really liked was this one. And the camera's to focus. Hello. Okay, there we go. Um, this one I did is the pencil. I don't know if it was pencil, but this thing is crinkled. It's old. There's a lot of eraser marks. And the pen, it's really light. Like, the pencil is really light. So, um, yeah, this is, like, one of the first ones I did, like, two other that look exactly like this except don't have the same like type of features maybe like the hair has bangs or like her lips are in a different position i don't know but like i did a series like three series of these so now i'm gonna show you um my so i have like style where i sometimes try not to do realistic and sometimes i don't and I try to do realistic, so I'll show you, um, this, this one looks, this one is the one, this I drew, my girl Taylor, that's not at what I drew, ready, this is what I drew, this is the face that I drew of Taylor Swift and her, like, original album, new album cover, and this you can see like a really big difference in everything like this compared to that it's a big it's a pretty big difference um another thing that i did it's not like the most realistic but it is at the same time it's this um i'm not a big fan of it that much anymore the lips are a little big, and this is not, this paper is not meant for coloring or anything. It's just for drawing and sketching. I forgot after I did the lips, so I was like, oh no. So then I just, just had to keep it that way. Because I really didn't have another choice. I was just like, I'm not going to do the whole thing. And plus, I don't have pencils that don't look yellow, <laughs> like the skin. You'll see it coming up, like something. Oh, I do self-portrait, and this is how it comes out with the yellow. Like, I don't have a good colored pencil that's going to do a good skin tone. Because I did a self-portrait, and it just did not, did not work. <laughs> um, and plus, I try to cover it with a style. I do have, like, the scrap here. I don't know if I can revive it or not. It's pretty smushed. I used double-sided tape to tape it to the face because I didn't like how it was colored in and stuff but you can kind of see that this was those are the eyes and this was the mouth and it was like I did that to cover it to kind of make it look cool but then I didn't I just hated it and then I took it off because it didn't even look like me I, I like I don't know what happened so yeah, that's basically my face comparisons. All right, now I am going to do dogs. So if I can even find, I don't know if this will be in here. It probably will. I have to find it. Hold on. This was, I'm looking right now in my very old notebook, and I'm not showing you anything because I don't know if I'm going to do... A, um, a, like, notebook review, like, showing all the old stuff. 
So, I'm actually, it's kind of confusing because I'm, like, turning pages and usually I'm flipping them. Um, like, vertically, not horizontally. Um, this you can even barely see. I'll, like, quickly trace out the outline. Kind of, like, I don't really know what was happening here today. No, I'm, like, that day. I was, like... Today, that would have been interesting if you see the doll that I'm going to show you. That's kind of, I don't even think that helped. I was trying to do draw my dog. Didn't really work. So that's basically the dog I was trying to draw. After drawing it, I got really impatient and it wasn't looking that great. So then I added spots, which just made it look like even weirder. So that's that dog. Now I'm going to show you my more recent dog. And you're probably wondering why I don't have these out. Because it's, I know, it's frustrating. Just pausing. Oh, here it is. <laughs> so, I actually, this is my more recent dog. Um, I really... <laughs> I love this so much. This is exactly what my dog looks like. I was actually doing a painting of my dog, and this is exactly what she looks like. It looks so much like her in the photo I was, like, trying to do of her. And it came out really good. And I, I don't really know what to say. I paint, did a painting of this. It's in school, and, you know, I can't get it. <laughs> so, um, I would love to show you it. During, it's now, like, April something. I don't, I don't even know what the date is. But I probably will do that. I'll probably show it to you guys, but it might be over the summer because I want to do a, like, painting review of everything I've done. I don't know when I'm going to get the paint back, but I want to show you guys when I do that, so. Who knows what's gonna happen? So yeah, it's a it's a I think it's a big difference. Um, it was hard because I had a like kind of do eyebrows because I don't know the facial expressions was something like that. I don't even know if they have eyebrows. I can't even tell. But I think I really like the difference that I've done. All right, next we have flowers. I really still don't, okay, so this one, a rose, I tried. These, I actually still kind of like that style. I think it's like cool, very like, not vibrant, but like smooth feeling. I don't know, it's, it's um, this, I don't, it's just at the time, flowers were not my thing. But now I kind of have some more inspiration. This is my new version of flowers. This is a watercolor painting. Um, I love this. The only bother thing is this and that. Like, these don't match. Like, they're, it's this looks so good. And then this one should be, like, tighter. Like, I don't understand what happened with that. When I was doing that, I really wish... Like, this looks like the flower I was doing, but this one looks like a different type of flower. I don't know. I really, I just, I do really love the flower itself. I just wish they were the same. Like, I, I don't know. But, yeah, that's my difference in flowers. So, this one is going to be a little weird. It's... Uh, I'm going to be, I mean, this is, I am going, I was deciding on if I should show, like, my difference with trees or something, I don't know, but then I found one that would go better with it. This is going to be my difference in painting mountains with water. So this was my first attempt. I loved this. I, I still like it. I like how I did the mountains. Um, and the stream kind of had some blending to show that it wasn't, like, all the same color. Um, I thought, like, is it going to get darker and darker and darker and darker, which makes no sense. But I think I kind of made it more white over here to make rushing water. I don't know. 
And then I kind of got really impatient with these and started finger painting with flowers. But I still overall like it. I like how I did the white lightly so you could still see the mountains behind it. But yeah, I really think that this came out good for me, what I was doing art at the time. But this is what I did now. So, it's a pretty big difference. Um, it literally, it, I took six hours, it, approximately six hours and three minutes on this. And, wait, it was, like, six, wait. Oh, I have paper. Okay, it's at approximately 6 hours, 3 minutes, and 22 seconds that I took on this. I, I, oh my god, this took so long to do. It was such a patient and cool experience. I, it was after Bob Ross, because I love Bob Ross so much, but... I just love this so much. The snow kind of on the trees made it so cool. Um, it was actually my first time using oil paints. Though I have some bothers that happened in this. Like, there's some stuff that I'm kind of like still really... You can't see it, but it's just not blended here. Also, that tip... Um, I know I'm pointing out so many, but it's not that big of a deal. Um, this white paint, I mean pink paint that got there. And this, what is that? It's like, shoo. but I can't blame myself. I have to say that I keep saying it, like the, I'm pointing out the back of the flaws, but you should just point out for you, you too. You don't point out the flaws, point out the success things like look how cool the mountains are or something like that i love the trees so much i think i did a really good job on them but yeah there's the big difference that came with that so this is my sunset this was um done with puffy paint which you know if you don't use it like as puffy paint then it was really see-through and that's what happened here it doesn't i don't know something about it i don't really like but i i think it's cool i i i like it but there is something that i don't like about it um i haven't figured that out yet <laughs> but once i do i think i want to fix this up and like help it out this is my old sunset so here is my new sunset um i've done many and way too many that is sunsets um i love this one although the blending job isn't great but i feel like that's a style right now just streaks i don't know um i absolutely love these palm trees that i did they're probably the best ones i've ever done there's so many things about this that i love um my old art signature that i would use i don't use that anymore but this absolutely is one of my favorite things that i've done i've hung it up in my room i took it down so i could show you um i, I really used to do the sun yellow Cause that's what you know when you're little you expect the sun is yellow but doing it white really gave it that vibrant shining sunset look and that's whatever i'm doing now i'm not doing it yellow so that is my sunset i really i'm happy with it uh, i've done many other sunsets that i'll show you So this one came out, it, it looks really cool, like, I don't know, um, I did this in art class, and my art teacher suggested, let me see, that looks better, my art teacher suggested to do it and add another palm tree here, there's not, there's like, 
two, 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 and then there's one. It looks, I just, the concept of it kind of just threw that away. Um, but again, I did the white sun. It looks cool. But the one thing that there is here to say is that, like, this was never like this. There is so many lumps. This is so thick paint. Like, for example, right here. Like, look at that. That is five layers of paint. Like, I messed up so badly. I th This was not supposed to be like this. And then it all was gray and black and white and mush together. I survived it now. And it has a weird reddish, grayish kind of thing. That's why... It's that color because of the gray. So, one of my other sunsets, not my last, I'm not going to show you anymore though, is this. Um, it is like, I love the shading that I did with the clouds. And this is kind of like a sunset I did after the sun goes down. And I had it blue to make it look like, like, it's still, like, a lot of sunsets, it's not blue anymore, but that's, like, part of a sunset, because the sky. And then this ocean is, like, so blended. I just kept using a brush. It was dry. There was literally this almost, the paint was almost dry fully, and the brush had nothing on it, and I just kept going like this, and it blended really well. And... I like, I really like this one, um, although this part is a little streaky there, but yeah, overall, I really liked the sunsets that I did, and as you can see, I have a lot, so. So, here's another one. This technically wasn't me trying, I guess I could say. It was like a really weird watercolor slash acrylic, which I should never do again. Um, cake. I don't know what I was thinking that day. There, it's a cone with no ice cream. Like, it's a cake. There's a cone on top of it, but where is the ice cream? Then, it's just, I just don't know what happened. Um, I just I don't like how it's, there's like a brownish grayish background. It's like a hot pink cake. Everything is hot pink too. Like, what? I don't know. Um, so I have two to show you. I don't know if the last, the second one is going to fit on camera, but I'm taking it off the wall. Um, this is a cake I did. I did this in art camp, and I really like the effect that it had, like, the combination of... It was just a vanilla cake with rainbow sprinkles. It was just a, you know, um, original, not original, just like um, a basic common confetti cake because that's what I did. And this, um, I have to say that I did this with markers and it's so streaky. I, I hate it like that. Um, I had alcohol, not really alcohol markers. They were just weird markers. I love them, and they're gone. I don't know where they are. I'm trying to look for them, but I just can't seem to see my hair. <laughs> I just can't seem to find them. So, that's one of them. That was, like, a common one, but this one is, like, an original cake that you can't... Oh, my God, the canvas is so heavy. Wow. This has to be, like, the biggest painting I've ever done. Um, yeah, it's not gonna fit. <laughs> um, I was, like, an ice cream. It's, like, um, a chocolate kind of... Maybe, like, a, it's a coffee cake, maybe? I don't know. I was going for a chocolate one. It didn't come out chocolate, chocolatey. I don't know. Chocolate, chocolatey. Um, I did, like, the cone, a normal color. I did ice cream like dripping and I did like a slice coming out it looks like generally so much better and it's kind of like 
only thing is though I had like gonna be strawberries along here there's a lot more planning that happened that I didn't just seem to have the patients doing which made it like completely bad so that's that I do love it though so this one is actually quite embarrassing um it's honestly I don't even know what happened the the one, the old one, is really good. This was me for just freehand drawing um, a simple ice cream cone. Like, I always do, just freehand drawing and seeing where it takes me. This actually was not, like, rated by me. Um, this, I really like. I like the colors and stuff like that. The sad thing is, though, is that the newer one is worse. <laughs> Did that, the, um, yeah, this is like one of the similar ones to the cake I just showed you that was old. That one day I was bored and I didn't know what to do and I just like did something random and it came out terrible. I have many more of those. <laughs> Which is pretty sad because I'm just wasting paper now. But it's like, I mean, what? A gold cone, first of all. I mean, the colors are cool, but, like, I just don't seem any liking to this. Like, and I just, I feel like a white background looks really cool, but, like, this just looks like I'm wasting the paper. So, yeah, that's the sad, sad comparison of things that I've done. Um, yeah. So, we're just gonna move away from that. So, um, this, what I'm going to show you, is pretty much not new, but it's not old. Well, okay, so this one is really old. It's like me not, it, this is me not even, I don't even know. And this is a comparison of an eye. It's so weird. Oh my god. I just can't. What the heck? Okay. Yeah, that's that. I'm just going to put this back up here because I did literally like eye for imagination. And then I on the back, I did um, crystal clear. And I don't know how to spell crystal at the time, sadly. So that's that. I think there's something missing. Hold on. Oh, boy. Okay, never mind. The newer version of an eye much better um it I <laughs> I absolutely love this eye but I'm serious this is like me coming home and doing it and be like wow I'm really proud of myself I actually have changed my eye I just don't have a single picture of it and here on the back was, like I said, drawing of trying to draw myself a long time ago. But yeah, that's my eye that I absolutely love because it's so tiny but so detailed. <laughs> so I'm literally running out of comparisons because I don't. I have so many different types of things. Um, I want to do something that's very like I don't know um this is something that just didn't come to mind for me ever um this is the newer version of this like because and also the only version this also kind of was not created by me it was created by someone else that I um really like it just the way they did this was really cool and inspired me to do it which i hope i inspire you to do um today i really don't know what else to do i feel like i had another like donut picture but i don't so we're just gonna put this back so yeah you can see that i'm literally fading <laughs> i don't know what to do um so that, I think, well, 
if you want to see another better kind of ice cream, that's something else I painted. Yeah. We're done here. Um, so that's basically um, the comparisons of, like, old to new stuff. I don't have that much stuff that I can compare anymore because it's all so different. Like, you can create a lot of different stuff. Like, I create stuff... I try to create stuff that's different than the last, except if I want to try to improve of that. Like, I don't want to keep drawing faces if I'm good at drawing faces, unless it's, like, not great, or it's, like, a really different kind of face. Because I'm going to show you something that is a little weird. Um, I don't know. It's It's a little weird. For example, there's two, there's like a million t types of faces that you can do. For example, look, this was something I did that was different. It's weird, I know, but it's different. It's supposed to be this really cool girl, and she has like frizzy hair, and you know you do that type of thing. This, literally, to me, is unique. It's different it's not like basically face after face after face it's not that it's just different you know I don't it's something other than that I mean the reason why I did like a bunch of those is because it was me first learning that I was really good at art and I should like start doing more of it so yeah that's basically what I'm trying to just tell everyone is that you can honestly create anything that you want and make it come out the way you want eventually because if you I know a bunch of people say to me oh my god I hate this I'm so bad at doing faces or something like that